What's up guys, so today I'll be making a new video about Fortnite Season 5 Lobbybot and how you can get a Lobbybot in the brand new season of Fortnite. And it's much easier than last season because there is a brand new hide feature that is free now with this Lobbybot. So before we do that, I just want to let you guys know that only 3% of you guys watching this right now are subscribed. So if you're not subscribed already, make sure to hit that subscribe button because it's free. You can always unsubscribe later if you would like. So the first thing we want to do is you're going to need a Discord account and you're also going to need Fortnite and this can be Fortnite on any platform that you want you can be on PC or you can also be on mobile or Xbox PS4 PS5 anything so once you've done that you want to head on into the discord and the link for that will be in the description and once you're inside the discord server you just want to head on into this channel called create recon it's on the left side under bot creator and this will basically allow you to type a command and create a bot so before you do that make sure you go into your settings and go to privacy and safety and make sure your dms are on otherwise this will not work and most people have their dms on by default so the command they want to type in here there's gonna be a lot of different people typing different commands but you gotta do exactly as i type so you type in plus start bot and once you do that it will appear in your dms right there so once it's in your discord dms it should pop up with an embed like this and it'll say like fortnite bot control panel and it'll say recon bot and the number of your recon bot and if you guys want me to make a video on how to get a bot with a custom name that you can change uh, make sure to like the video if we get 200 likes on this video i will make that video so we have recon bot right over here so you want to just copy the name or if you're on any other platform besides pc you can just type with whatever keyboard or whatever you have so you're just gonna head on into fortnite right now you're gonna go over here you're gonna go to add friends and you're just gonna paste or just type depending on what your platform is so once that's in just do add friend and your friend will go up because it'll automatically accept the friend request very very simple and you're just gonna scroll down to recon bot so here it is, Recon Bot, and you're just gonna click on Invite. And it cannot, you cannot invite it to the party. So we're gonna join the party. Now we're just gonna join the party. Okay, so we've just joined their party and we have Recon Bot right over here. So the first thing you wanna do once it's joined your party is head on down over here and you just wanna type in exclamation point hide. This is a new feature that they just added that will hide all of the other players. And there we go, we just hit everybody. And you can see we have recon bot is the only person that you can see so it's pretty realistic if you want to like prank your friends or something by sharing your screen uh once we've done this if you want to like change the level or something to make it not look uh weird then all you gotta do is go over here and you just want to type in exclamation point level and then we'll type in like a realistic level like you know like level 20 or something because the season just started so there you go level has just been changed to 20 and then we just want to change the skin to whatever you want Oh, you can also change the banner because this is a weird banner so we can just change the banner like this type in exclamation point banner and we can do a number from 1 to 28 so why don't we go with like 2 or something let's see what it does there you go change to like an apple that's pretty cool and then uh, you can also ready it up to make it look like it's ready it's not gonna actually put you into a game or anything even if you're both readied up but we can do that so make it ready and the bot will be ready there we go the bot has just changed to ready pretty simple and now for the part that you guys probably wanted we're going to be changing the skin so we're going to head on into this and we're going to do set skin so we're going to do exclamation point skin and we're just going to type in the skin that we want so let's say let's see what the battle pass has let's see what the number level 100 is on the battle pass so if we go on over here level 100 is going to be Oh, these are the wrong pages okay here we go so level 96 there you go level 100 is where you get the final mandalorian uh level 96 is menace so we can get menace Let's see what that does and there we go we should have menace so there you go we have menace and let's see if we can get anything else let's try like skull trooper so we can get the so we can get the purple skull trooper and we got skull trooper and then if you want to change the variants on these skins it's pretty simple you just do skin skull trooper you do dash v 
equals then you type in the thing that you want so we're gonna say purple glow and there you go we just got purple glow on the skull trooper and this will work for any of the variants on any other skin that you want so if you want to do that then you can change that as well and if you want to see what variants it has you can just do show variants name so if we go back to menace since i know you guys probably want the menace skin the final one of that so we're going to do skin menace and now we're going to do show variants menace and we will be able to see the variants so i guess the skin variant uh the skin menace has no variants so the recon bot has not added the variants to for menace yet but we can do another skin So we can do it for, let's see, uh, we can do it for Ghoul Trooper, and, oh, I put a space in that, so we're going to copy that, delete this. So here's all the Ghoul Trooper styles, so if you do skin, Ghoul Trooper, and then you just do dash dash v equals, and then you can type in any of these that you want, so we can say pink. Now I guess the pink ghoul trooper. Here we have the pink ghoul trooper now. And let's see what else, what other battle pass people there are. There's Reese. I'm pretty sure there is skin styles for Reese. So let's see. And Reese has no variants. So it looks like they don't have it for a lot of uh, the new season five skins yet. So we can see if we go back to any of the older skins with skin styles. So we could do like the maybe the Wolverine. Yeah, that has only two styles, or maybe it's three. So we can go back to Wolverine and let's try that. So we'll do show variants, and we can see that Wolverine. There you go. Wolverine has many different ones. We can even get the silver foil, gold foil, and hollow foil. So a lot of you guys were asking in the recent videos how to get the different foils from last season. And this will also work for the enlightenment uh, styles as well from the previous seasons, like the gold or fully gold or anything. You can also do that. So if we want to get the different hollow Wolverine, just copy this. And we're going to do skin. So we can just copy it from above so it's less to type. Wolverine. This will also work with like Iron Man. Wolverine. And we're going to say V equals gold foil. And then we have the gold Wolverine. So this is really cool. Uh, now we can go and check out some other stuff. So there's many different uh, commands that you can use. So let's see. Let's check out the other ones. So you can change the pickaxe, you can change the backpack, and you can also change the emote. So we're gonna do the backpack. This will basically just change the back bling to whatever you want. So what we want to do is we make a ghost portal. And that'll make it to obviously the ghost portal back bling. And you can only see it with some emotes. So now we're gonna check out the emotes. And again, if you guys wanna check out any of the other commands, they're all up here. They're pretty self-explanatory for most of them. And if you have a question, just let me know in the comments. So if you want emotes, all you gotta do is type in the emote, and you're gonna do emote floss, and that'll get you like the emote that you want. So it's pretty cool. Hopefully you guys enjoy the video, and if you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in another one.